What are you listening to? Huh? What are you listening to? Henry the Blasian. Brand new. Not even out yet. I feel alive again. I know I gotta win. And I've been on my way. Ain't no abandoning. Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another HTB video. And today we got some new season rewind packs, which usually I don't really care for. And then I saw that my fellow Canadian was in there and I had to pick him up. 99 overall, Dark Matter, RJ Barrett. Now, usually the season rewind players, they're going for a lot of MT. It's usually more the Galaxy Opals or the Pink Diamonds. But as far as the Dark Matters, they're actually somewhat balancing in price. I paid 125K for this RJ Barrett, which might be worth it. It might not, but on the bright side, it wasn't like the 300K the Dark Matters used to go for earlier in the year. Today, we're here to see just how good of a card this is, if he's gonna be worth the price and worth adding to your squad. Now, as always, if you are new to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button we're on that journey to 300k before nba 2k22 i want to make it happen i hope you make it happen if you enjoy the content and let's aim for 2,000 likes on today's video but with all that being said man rj barrett let me see what you're all about because the man was hooping this year a lot of people were sleeping on rj because the knicks weren't the greatest last year this year they were definitely doing some damage 99 offense 99 defense six foot seven I don't know why I always thought he was six foot six. Maybe they updated his height. I don't remember. But 94 driving layup, 94 draw foul, 95 midi, 96 three ball, 90 free throw, 95 driving dunk. The tendencies are there. Ball handling and passing are looking decent. The defense looks great. 94 steal, 96 perimeter. A bit low on that interior, but I'm not guarding a center. Decent rebounding, very good speed. 93 speed with ball there, 95 strength. 95 lateral quickness and the mental game it's looking good let me see what the defensive tendencies are all about and i'm pretty happy with them 98 pass 95 on ball and contest and a 94 shot block we get into the badges 56 hall of fame badges which is very nice but only four gold which i thought would be a little bit higher because that's only a total of 60 badges there's still 15 more badges he can hold so let's just hope he has space to hold all the important ones but uh we're looking at hall of fame catch and shoot hall of fame corner specialist difficult shots acrobat post spin technician ankle breaker heat seeker dimer me mama pickpocket clamps defensive leader heart crusher interceptor intimidator post riser pogo stick post lockdown that's actually super nice for only having 70 interior uh you got the circus and deep threes but of course no blinders badge uh giant slayer rhythm shooter bailout downhill handles for days needle threader quick first step space creator tight handles clutch shooter dead eye stop and pop green machine hot zone hunter bullet passer like they really did juice him with most of the right badges i can't think of what he's missing off the bat besides blinders even got gold rebound chaser but uh he's missing brick wall put back so a lot of the big man stuff rim protector is definitely a badge you want to have on him worm wouldn't be too bad blinders is likely going to be the most important one if you're on next gen if you're on current gen you likely just want to give him the rim protector and he should honestly be fine because i don't care about the drop stepper or brick wall or put back boss or anything like that but otherwise man rj barrett you're looking solid on paper i can't wait to see what our fellow canadian can do for us today so without further ado ladies and gentlemen let's hop into a game and let's see what rj barrett is really all about let's get into it all right ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another htb gameplay we're in madison square garden so you know we got to put on a show this man's getting super aggressive with Giannis. oh my goodness i really almost got dunked on rj barrett's got the ball right, let's make something happen finesse that thank you curry side get in front of him pull for the mid-range and that's a green to start the game good defense there by rj barrett under the basket he's got the rebound all right let me slow things down because Barrett right now, it looks like he wants to give this Devin Booker the work. Hit that screen, thank you. Curry side. Pull for three again. Bang! Now that jumper is so nice though. That's one thing I like about Barrett's jumper. Every single year it's been so money. Let's go back to Barrett. All right, here comes an alley-oop with Shaq because they can be legendary. Barrett is stuck. Why is he stuck like that? Pass the ball. What? Timeout, timeout, timeout. This man was stuck in one position. Pause. But what was that? Give me in the post. I see Tatum swinging to Shaq. He's got that jumper. Come on. Let's go, baby. All right, let's get back to business. I can't believe my player just got stuck for no reason. All right, let's try to get Barrett going just a little bit. Beautiful off-ball deodorant. We run it perfectly. Wide open. And once again, it's another green, man. That jumper is really a vibe. Do I have takeover yet? I know it's sharpshooting, but once I get it, it's over. Nice rebound there. Come on, let's push it. RJ Barrett, let's get you takeover. Shaq, 
Dimer me mama, not a green, oh, but it's baby, a bucket again. It. Bro, Shaq with that new jumper, it just looks so wrong. Like, it doesn't even look right. Throw it this way. Thank you. That's a steal. Let's go. Right to RJ. Alley oop that. Hey! Let's go. Good defense there by Shaq in the second quarter. RJ, you got to start sprinting to the basket. I need to see one dunk this game. Look at him showing violence, man. This RJ Barrett card's hooping. I, I swear I forgot he was 6'7". I don't know why. We're definitely doing our thing this game. Shaq doesn't want to miss today, so let me finesse that. Thank you. Curry side. Oh, yeah. Driving right by again. Jimmy Butler isn't holding me. You better put on some new settings, man. Come on. Y'all see that, right? We got a new boy in town with TakeOver. Let me see what kind of damage I can do. You better be setting doubles. Oh, look at him hitting that square button. Getting real aggressive there, LaMelo. Hezzy, there we go. I'm about to finesse the life out of this Jimmy. Look at that. Stop. Cross him up. Curry side. Too much space. Oh, my God. Goodness, RJ Barrett, turn me up. This dude has Michael Porter Jr. and he still hasn't locked in for Bobo. Bowl Bowl. That's kind of an L. All the way through, easy layup animation right there. And RJ Barrett cannot be stopped right now. He can't. Got stuck in a jump ball situation right here. We're going to win it though. Right back to Barrett. Oh, that's backcourt. I didn't think he'd step forward. He just paused on me. Oh, nah, you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. You better double team me when RJ has the ball. Yo, did you see that animation? What is going on with this game? Nice little crossover step in. Easy mid range. Easy buckets right there. Come on. If you're going to pause on me, at least get buckets. Yo, what is this spacing? I know you're trying to sprint to my body. Easy blow by stopping. I'll keep pulling for the mid range, man. Come on now. I'm Chris Paul out here. Good defense there by RJ Barrett. Terrible shot. Come on. Let's run with it, boys. We move. We move. Dwight Howard has he? Thank you. Nice little blow by. Right to RJ. Going straight to the basket all the way through. Oh! If we dunked that, Horace Grant would have been my son. RJ Barrett would have given birth today, and his name would have been Horace Grant. What? All right, that free throw animation, fairly, fairly easy. Kind of looks like it's a big man free throw. I'm not going to lie, but second one right here, also going down 23, 3, and 3 for RJ Barrett. Let's end this quarter off on a good note. Jab step. Oh, nice little spin there by Luka. All the way in dunking on his teammate, Porzingis. Do you guys think Porzingis is going to stay on the Mavericks or no? In the second half here, and all this guy has done is hit full white. So I need a new game plan. He's really double teaming RJ Barrett every single time. Bill Russell, I need you to knock down your threes and we're vibing. Easy blow by. Thank you. See you later. Straight to the basket. Nobody's in front of me and I'm putting it down. Come on. Throw all the double teams. I'm ready for it. Good defense. Oh, that's not a block. We're down four points. I know he's going to send a double from somewhere. I just got to know from where. LeBron wide open. 4-3. Dimer me, mama. Come on. Let's go. Let's get one stop, please. I need one good dribble move. Thank you, Curry side. See you later. All the way to the basket again. RJ Barrett gets an easy layup right there. He basically has no stamina. He now has two people in takeover. We need a stop. Good defense. Oh, 60. I'm speechless. I'm speechless. I mean, I've done it before in TakeOver, so I can't be as mad. But come on, 2K. Man, hits full whites and then proceeds to hit that. That's crazy. Curry side. Oh, finesse that. Thank you. Get right there, Luca. That's all you. Easy greens. Sauce the man up. We got the starters back in here. Let's just get some composure and let's do our thing. RJ Barrett on that off-ball deodorant. Automatic money. I think so. Dimer me, mama. 32 points for the young boy. Does he have TakeOver yet? No. Pump fake. Who is that open? Jason Tatum. Dimer me. Bang. Big time three, man. All right, one stop. I know he's looking to hit that square button, so finesse that. Come on. Hit that screen so Shaq can start rolling. No rolls. No problem. All the way for RJ himself. I'll take it myself. Lock it down. Lock it down. Lock it down. Good defense. Lock it down. He's got five seconds to make something happen. Stupid. Dirk, you got to stay in front of him. I got takeover, so we're chilling. Nice little curry side. Try to guard me as tight as you want. None of that's happening. Get off me, man. We're winning this game no matter what. Let's throw some bait. Let's throw some bait. Let's throw some bait. Throw some bait. There we go. That's a steal. Oh, that's not a steal. This game is so wild. Okay. Nope. Don't get angry. Don't get angry. Still only a tie game. Send all the doubles. Send all the doubles. Finesse that. Thank you. Hit that screen. Thank you. See ya. You're on my side. That's a bad pull. And we green it. He got a contested three. I get one too. Come on. He can go all the way. He's going all the way. Good extra pass. Good defense. No way that goes down, right? Good defense. Come on, Diesel. Turn me up. Right to RJ. Curry side. Open three. Bang! RJ Barrett. Give me a fake screen. Thank you. Dirk, start rolling. There we go. Go all the way and put it down. Easy ball movement. He really cocked that all the way back to try to get blocked. 
Let me get a pick and roll here, RJ. He's looking right at you. Hit that screen, thank you. Start rolling. I got you. Hey, Jimmy Butler, where were you, man? Don't throw it to Jimmy. I saw that. Thank you. What a touchdown steal. That's a clutch steal right there. Finesse this. Pick and roll. Is he in a zone? No, he's not. So go inside to the diesel. Put it down. Almost got blocked there, but I'll take the bucket. He's in a zone. Let me throw a dot to Dirk. Go in here. Thank you. Dirk Nowitzki. Nail in the coffin, and that's the game, man. What a performance there in the second half. We almost blew this game. And that right there is going to be the game, ladies and gentlemen. We win 83 to 74. GG's to my opponent. RJ Barrett went crazy. I knew I was going to get buckets, but my goodness. Let's go ahead. Let's check out the box score. And let's see how our boy did. And as you guys can see, man, one of the most efficient 46-point games a man can have. In 20 minutes, RJ Barrett had 46 points. Three rebounds, seven assists. That stat line alone is crazy. He was really dishing the rock and giving the man a 46 piece. 19 for 24 from the field. And even better, six for eight from three. Like I was saying, man, that new jumper, absolutely amazing. Perfect from the free throw line. A total of eight dunks this game and definitely clutched up in that second half. What were the stats? Yeah, in the second half, he had 23 points, 10 for 13 and three for five from three. That is so crazy. But uh, all around, man, as you guys were able to see, RJ Barrett is a bucket. Now, the question as to whether this card's going to be worth it or not is entirely up to you at this point in the year. If you're a Knicks fan or an RJ Barrett fan, I'm going to say it's definitely worth it because, again, it's likely the best RJ Barrett we're going to get for the rest of the year. We got like two months left in this year of my team. So if you have the MT to spend, have some fun. Pick up the RJ Barrett because we all know he's not going to be a top tier shooting guard. We got people like T-Mac out there. Kevin Durant, Andre Karolinko. Like, if you're trying to be super competitive, he's obviously not going to be the card to pick up, but he's still going to be able to compete at a very good level and get you dubs. His animations are amazing. You saw the dunks, you saw the jumper. He actually plays very good defense, even though we didn't get a steal there. He was bumping people a lot, which was super nice. And uh, all around, man, this RJ Barrett is definitely giving me the NBA 2K20 RJ Barrett vibe. And the crazy thing is, I wasn't even quick stopping with this card. Like, his jumper is nice. If you know how to quick stop consistently, on next gen then you're gonna be an absolute demon when it comes to barrett his only flaw to be honest is the fact that he's not six foot ten that's the only flaw but aside from that he can basically do everything else i like this card a lot i'm likely gonna keep him on the squad i was gonna sell him back because i paid 130k for him but he's a fellow canadian all canadians they stay in my collection it's just the way it goes and this rj man now hopefully next year rj bear goes crazy during the season and he can get more love from media like zion and lamello but we'll have to see but uh all around as far as the my team card goes guys i mean just like every card at this point in the year it's a bucket it really just comes down to how much you're willing to pay in mt and rj barrett i'm not gonna lie he's definitely up there you're likely gonna see him on the team for future gameplays just because he's one of those cards i like a lot i'm not gonna say he's a top tier shooting guard but i really do like this card but uh with that being said this is gonna be the end of the video if you guys did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like and for you new viewers you know you gotta hit that subscribe button and join the blazing nation i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you all have an awesome day and take care